The Samsung Galaxy phone right now is having a lot of Wi-Fi issues. Sometimes it won't connect to Wi-Fi, sometimes it does. So if you're having right now any Wi-Fi issue on your Samsung Galaxy phone, this is your video. Let me show you what you need to do to get a fix. Let's go. The first thing we're going to do, guys, let's make sure there's no app turning on and off the Wi-Fi connection. To do that, it's really easy. What you want to do, let's go ahead and open the settings. Then let's go ahead and click on connections. Let's go ahead and click on Wi-Fi. Let's go ahead and click on those three dots at the top right side. Then let's go ahead and click on advanced settings. Okay, right here you will see this setting, Wi-Fi on and off history. Let's go ahead and click on that. And guys, if for some reason there's app on your phone turning off and on the Wi-Fi connection, you will see it right here in this page. So if you see any app right here, just click on the app and remove the app because that app is causing problem on your phone. So Wi-Fi issue. So, but if you don't see apps right here, let's jump to the next solution. Let's go ahead and open the settings. Now let's go ahead and click on connections. Then let's go ahead and click on Wi-Fi. So what you're going to do guys, you're going to forget the Wi-Fi network that you have connected to your phone right now. So to do that, let's go ahead and click on the setting icon right here. Then just click on forget this network right on the bottom. And right now for you to connect uh, your phone to the same Wi-Fi network, you will have to type in the password. But before you install the connection, restart your phone. So you will have to press the power button and restart your Samsung Galaxy phone. So that way we'll start fresh. Okay, let's go, unlock your phone. Now let's go ahead and click on settings. Let's go ahead and click on connections. Then let's go ahead and click on Wi-Fi. So let's wait a few seconds until you see your Wi-Fi name. If you see it, just open it. And now you will have to type in the password. Then let's go ahead and click on connect. Your phone should be good to go right now. But if you still got the same problem, let me show you what else you have to do. If your phone is recently having Wi-Fi issue, what you're gonna do, you're gonna force restart your phone. That will fix any system issue or any Wi-Fi issue. So because sometimes guys it's just system issue to do that it's really easy you're gonna press and hold down volume down and power button at the same time until your phone turn off let's do it it will take like 15 seconds so just keep those button downs until your phone turn off as soon as your phone turn off release both buttons your phone will turn it back on automatically you don't have to press any button as you can see it's turning back on just wait once your phone turn it back on just unlock your phone and let's see if your phone now is working the wi-fi so it should connect to your wi-fi network automatically because it was connected before but if you still see that it won't connect to wi-fi so what i recommend you to do just open the settings then let's go ahead and click on connections let's go ahead and click on wi-fi and now just turn off the wi-fi setting and turn it back on so you don't have to wait and it should connect to your wi-fi network without no problem so if you say connected right here but let's see if you still got the same problem or let's say your phone is already connected to your wi-fi network and the problem is that your wi-fi keeps disconnecting and connecting by itself like it keeps randomly disconnecting from your wi-fi so let me show you how to fix that Let's go to the main page, main menu. Let's go ahead and open the settings. Let's go ahead and click on connections. Now let's go ahead and click on Wi-Fi. Let's go ahead and click on those three dots on the right side at the top. Then let's go ahead and click on intelligent Wi-Fi, the second setting. Now you will see this setting, switch to better Wi-Fi network. Turn off that setting guys, because this setting automatically switch to Wi-Fi networks that are faster or more stable than your current network so just turn it off it says right here also to prevent interruptions this only happens when the screen is off it no matter just turn it off now let's say you still got the same problem what you're gonna do let's go ahead and open the setting scroll the way down let's go ahead and click on so far update and if you have a new update available right in this section you will have to do it so you have to do it because sometimes as you can see this phone right now has a new update sometimes when your phone and when you don't update your phone when your phone is not up to date your phone start getting connection issue so you will have to update your phone software but let's say you don't have any available software okay so what you're gonna do let's go ahead and open the settings on your phone one more time then let's go ahead and search right here for reset reset network setting just type in reset network settings and you will see the setting right at the top let's go ahead and click on that then let's go ahead and click on reset network settings and right here before you reset your network settings let me explain to you what this is gonna do so as you can see right here this will reset all network settings including those for wi-fi 
mobile data and bluetooth sometimes guys we move setting on the phone that we don't know if that gonna affect any function of the phone and the only solution guys is just resetting the network settings okay by doing that you will have to reconnect your phone to wi-fi also you will have to connect any bluetooth device that you had connected to your phone before that being said let's go ahead and click on reset settings you will see this message right here network setting reset so now just restart your phone turn off your phone and turn it back on everything will start fresh like that once your phone turn it back on just um search for your wi-fi network Type in the password that's supposed to fix any connection issue on your phone just unlock your phone open the settings let's wait a few seconds to open the settings okay um, open the settings connections wi-fi search for your wi-fi network just type in the password then click on connect and your phone should be good to go also i was about to say guys if you install any app on your phone and then after that you start getting like connection problem wi-fi issue so you should delete the app at least for to confirm that the app is not interfering with your wi-fi connection so what you're gonna do just open the settings scroll all the way down let's go ahead and click on apps just look for the app right here and just click on it for example, let me click on Netflix. Let's say Netflix is the app that I just installed on my phone. Just click on it and just uninstall the app. You will see down here the uninstall button. Click on it and just OK. After you uninstall the app, just restart your phone. All the time, guys, when you do something on your phone, restart your phone. Just press the power button, then click on restart. Just wait until your phone turn it back on and try to connect your phone to Wi-Fi to see now if your Wi-Fi is working. You should also, guys, connect other phones to your Wi-Fi network to see if it is your network uh, that have the issue or your phone. So obviously, if you connect different phones to your network and computers, whatever device you have, a part of your phone, and you see that it's working perfectly, that means your phone is the problem. But if you see all the devices are having the same issue with the Wi-Fi connection, that means your Wi-Fi connection have the issue. So then what you should do, just turn off your router for like 30 minutes, guys, because sometimes your router right now can be overheat and that will cause any connection issue. Just turn it off, unplug your router from the wall completely, and that will help guys just leave it like that for 30 minutes after 30 minutes connect your router turn on your router and try to connect your phone to your wi-fi network to see if now everything is working the way it have to be if you already have done everything that i show you in this video and you still got the same problem then you will have to restart the whole phone to reset the whole phone so to reset that means you will um, delete everything you will erase the whole phone you know what i mean in case there's something on your phone the software that is causing the problem but for that i'm gonna leave two videos in the description down below just go right there and watch it so i'm gonna be showing you in this video how to uh, factory reset your phone if you like this video like the video don't forget to subscribe and see you in my next video